not my style. It's not saying. It's got to go. Don't be swayed by brand. If it's not your style, don't buy it. Do not surround yourself with a collection of luxury bags that is plastered against my wall because I am going to get my cost for wear out of all these and because they are all my it bags and I really love them and then next week it's time to declutter you know you have to cleanse your system and you have to start the season fresh let's do that I've been thrifting I've been thrifting and it's a good thing to do in my line of business. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. As you guys know, on this channel, sustainability matters and we embrace imperfect sustainability. So today, like most of my videos, I'll be sharing with you a couple luxury items that didn't even sway my decision making to return them. You see, I am not caught up by brand name. I am caught up by quality. And at the same time, my taste is absolutely different. My style is different than most of the people that are out there. You, some people may not even like my style, but if you do, I'm so happy. Do be inspired. So I made this purchase and this is a secondhand purchase. You know me. This piece I bought and I would not even name the platform because, yeah, I bought it from them because it's supposed to be the it brand of the moment, not the it bag, but the it brand. And according to them, if you know, you know, but if you don't know, who cares, right? Personally, I don't care. So, this, if you know the logo, you know what it is. And while it may be somebody's cup of tea, uh, I don't know. It's a vintage piece, by the way, and I, lo I love vintage. It's not doing much for me. And that is essentially because this is made of coated canvas and this is not a piece that would last forever. You could see that despite being vintage, it held up okay, but if it was leather, it would definitely hold up better because the other pieces that are vintage that are in my wardrobe definitely held up well so i am sharing this with you because there are so many bags out there right now that are canvas coated canvas and it's not my cup of tea it it's not a forever bag it starts stripping and And it start becoming disgusting and I don't care what brand you are and that is not to say that the bag doesn't look or appear well with almost everything in my closet it does it's one of the reasons why I bought it in the first place but at the same time you have got to recognize when something would not have longevity in your closet so there's no point holding on to something that's not going to give you your cost per way or that you're not going to enjoy. While 
this brand. Some people call this canvas. This is not canvas. This is actually really strong fabric material. This is a piece that would last you forever if you have it in your wardrobe. To that, I would say, if you know, you know. And I'm not talking about brand. I'm talking about your materials. That is something that you should keep in mind whenever you're buying, regardless of the brand. Don't be swayed by brand. Oh, the, yeah. But anyway, so you would see a couple other items that I am sharing with you that are not my style. And if it's not my style, it's not same. It's got to go. I have an upcoming surgery. I do not really have a bag for me to take as an overnighter. So I decided to purchase this bag. It's a Burberry piece. It really looks nice on the website. And I got this piece from Poshmark. It's pretty, but one of the things the seller didn't quite display is this. It's already falling apart right there. The seller showed the other floors except right there and I can't accept that because it also has other flaws as well so the inside zipper runner is missing that was disclosed to me so I don't mind but at the same time yeah I see packing this it's just gonna totally destroy it and it's not for me it's not worth it so I'm going to try to return it. But yeah, it's the classic Burberry print. The longer strap is also missing. But this is what it looks like. Yeah, so I think as much as it looks okay, I'm going to return it and try to get something else. This is the third item I purchased and I really love the description of this particular piece. It was described as a men's 42 large Armani long cashmere and wool coat in khaki green. Perfect. Perfect for what I wanted because at the same time it was also from tweed and I absolutely love to eat. I think this is working. The silhouette isn't great. Sometimes it doesn't matter the brand, as long as it doesn't fit you well, even when it meets fabric expectations still, it doesn't mean that you have to keep something that you don't see yourself wearing a lot. Green is great. It's not really green as I expected it. This is khaki. She said the outer shell is green. The outer shell is not green unless I'm colorblind and I'm not yet. Only look great with a belt and I'm not going to be belting every single time, right? I mean, belted, it could probably work, but do I always have to do this? What about when I just want to wear it? 
casually with jeans open yeah it doesn't give me that right silhouette but right now it has that big oversized sleeve that I've seen in some high-end jackets right now that big rounded kind of shoulder like this Item number four is what I perceive was a gorgeous Burberry coat. Look at the fabric. It's a hundred percent wool, perfect fabric. But guys, when this piece came, it was peeling so badly. And again, the silhouette wasn't working for me. Ah, oh, guys, never settle because it's a high-end brand so i hope that you really take inspiration from this don't be swayed by brand if it's not your style don't buy it if it's not your color that complements you if it doesn't fit well into your wardrobe do not buy it do not surround yourself with a collection of luxury bags that is plastered against my wall because I am going to get my cost for wear out of all these and because they are all my it bags and I really love them and then next week um you know I'm gonna have a sale it's time to declutter you know you have to cleanse your system and you have to start the season fresh let's do that you can go on my Poshmark which by the way I do have one and you can also go on my Depop you could go be mindful be intentional fabric fit and style is my current mantra if you want to borrow it go right ahead Hope you enjoyed this video. Love you guys, and I'll see you soon. When they do what they do, and now I feel like taking off, find a place with the view. The pain is never gonna stop if it's.